Hey everyone, this is Ryan on the Syntax Byte. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to retain leading zeros when you open a CSV file in Excel with the latest Microsoft Office 365. Now this method only works for Microsoft Office 365. So if you're on 2016 or even later than that, uh, I don't believe it will work. You can always check, it's very easy. Um, but to get started here, let's just take a quick look um, with Notepad on my CSV. So I've got a number and a name. And you can see I have some leading zeros here. And you can see that by default, when I open this up in Excel, uh, my leading zeros have been removed. So that's not what I want to have happen. So what I can do is I can just go over to Options. I might have to go to More and then Options. And then if you go down to Data, you can see under Automatic Data Conversion, this is basically what Excel is doing when it's opening the file. And you can, you can Disable them all if you want. Um, it's got a couple of other ones here, but you could just untick remove leading zeros and convert to a number and say, okay. It's not gonna make any changes to the file that you just opened, but that's okay. Just close that out, go ahead and open it again. And just like that, you can see that Excel is now storing these as text. Uh, it's not automatically uh, doing that conversion. If you do wanna convert them, you can just uh, go ahead and convert it to a number. And if you just wanna get rid of these errors, you can just go ignore error. Uh, so that's how you can retain uh, leading zeros when you open CSV files in Excel with Microsoft Office 365. I hope that was helpful. Once again, it's been Ryan on the Syntax Byte. Go ahead and give this video a like if it helped you out. Subscribe to the channel for more tips like this, and I'll see you in the next one.